Hey you guys, this is Dash from Bloom Where You're Planted and I have been one sick chick with one sick chick. We're both sick chicks. <laughs> this is like a horrible flashback to the fall, the end of summer, fall, when my chickens got sick, they got a respiratory illness, I lost a couple of them, I got sick. I'm hoping it's just a coincidence that we're both sick with respiratory stuff at the same time. But, so, she is getting VetRx, which is basically a menthol treatment for chickens. And I'm getting essential oils. And we are both getting fire cider. I made, made some up um, a couple months ago. And this is the rest of it. If you don't know what fire cider is, it's a homemade remedy for cold and flu. And if you go down in the video description, um, you can get a recipe and I did a video on how to make it so you can make it with me for yourself. And I've been kind of um, thinking, well, it didn't work this time because sometimes you can take it right when you feel the illness coming on and it just knocks it out. You don't get sick at all. But it wasn't working like that this time and I was kind of down on it. But at the same time, I'm not at the doctor. I haven't been to the doctor and I'm getting better. So I know several friends that have gotten this same type illness and had to go to the doctor and gotten antibiotics and a shot of steroids. So, and then they had to go back to the doctor again and get different antibiotics. So, you know what, it's keeping me out of the doctor, so I think it is working. It's just that this is a tough bug to beat. All right, so, but I'm a little bit worried about my chickens on this cold, rainy, 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 rainy week. I'll show you why. It is so muddy in the chicken yard, you guys. Ugh. Which is bad enough. But let's look in the coop. Somehow, the roof dripped. Not sure how that happened. But the inside of the coop is wet. So having the chicken yard wet and muddy, it's not that big of a deal, but having it wet in here is a huge deal. No wonder I'm seeing a respiratory infection. So I really need to get this cleaned up. What I really need to do is go to the feed store and get a bale of straw for out here and a country boy wood chips wood shavings for in here but I'm afraid we're a bit short on funds at this present time I, I love when the English speak if you're from across the pond love it because it sounds so much better than the American and yeah, we're broke yeah it's so much better when they say it I don't know right so <clears throat> and my dad's from Scotland so he could say for instance quit ya bite again to the dog quite fiercely and I mean doesn't that sound amazing yeah I don't know maybe it's just me all right so what I do have is a bale of hay straws used for bedding hay is used for food I get that it's for the rabbits but that's what I have for right now so I think I'm gonna try to get this coop um, dried out for them to be in tonight and that means I need to solve the problem of the roof. <laughs> yeah, that could definitely be part of my problem. So, let's see what I can do with this situation. <laughs> They're all coming to join the party. All right. <laughs> Help spread it out for me, girls. 
Unfortunately, I think the rain event is over for a few days. We're waiting for sunshine. That's what's predicted anyway. All right, but it's gonna get cold. So I've gotta get this situation dried off a bit. That's it, get to work. Good girls. Okay, now let's see what we can do about this coop. Maybe I can get it angled up a bit so the rainwater just rolls off of it. We'll see what I can do. today. Still beautiful though. It's about this time that I wish a country boy, which is what they call a bag of wood shavings, really was a real helpful, strong com country boy. We're gonna do this though. We've got this. Maybe. All right, I'm gonna just worry about the water. I worry about the slant on the coop after I get it cleaned up. So I'm gonna clean this out and get it dried up. I do have one country boy, not a real country boy, wood shaving country boy um, in the garage. So I can use that. So that's awesome. Let's do this. you can clearly see that the struggle is real folks. <laughs> Urban farming is sometimes taking care of animals when you're sick um, but there are those days those sunny days when it is fun and it is so nice to get out and you know there there are a lot of days when it's really rewarding this just isn't one of them <laughs> Okay, you guys, now all we have to do is get this emptied out, cleaned out, and dry stuff put in there. So I really, I really hope my husband doesn't watch this video because my strict instructions for today were, I'm glad you're feeling better, take it easy. Yeah, somehow I don't think this is what he had in mind. <laughs> it was not what I had in mind either, but yeah, it happens. Okay, it is what it is. Let's do this. You'll hear it just, I was gonna say, you'll hear that my rooster is trying to compete with the fire truck that just took off. He thinks it's a really big rooster. Yeah. Fun. Urban farming. Gotta love it. Okay, you guys, I've just got two things to say. This stuff is a lot heavier wet. I'm just saying, that's not fair, but it is what it is. And then the other thing I have to say is that this day, I always say, on a day like this, it could use a little show tunes. Sun will come out tomorrow bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow do you kind of wish that was a real thing like there's kind of a, a voiceover of show tunes whenever you needed them yeah me too no 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 you are not no you are not gonna dump that out no you are not no you are not I don't care if you are my best egg layer no 
No. Get back. Get back. Oh, I think I made it too heavy. <laughs> over with I'm due for a good hot soak in the tub what do you guys think <laughs> All right, you guys, I think I'm gonna let this dry out for a couple hours. If it rains, I'm just gonna throw a fit. It's just like a two-year-old. No, it's too muddy to throw myself down on the ground. Never mind. I'm gonna just take it in like a big girl. All right, so I am gonna let this dry out for a few hours, I think, and I'm gonna go in and get some hot tortilla soup. <laughs> Check back with you in a bit. All right, you guys, I'm all full of tortilla soup and feeling better. So, I'm gonna finish this off and let's hope I can get this baby back on here tonight. All right, let's do this. Now this is the country boy I was talking about. Yep, not the real country boy, but I'm glad to have this. Yeah. Now here goes my attempt at slanting the roof on a moment's notice. I screw it in but I don't have my country boy so I'll just have to put it back first Maybe I can put the board on. <sighs> okay, you guys, it's not near enough of a slant, so I'm gonna try to take this little board off right here. I sure wish I could fast forward my life like I could the camera. <laughs> right. Thank you. 
pronto. Okay, I got that board off, so now it might be enough of a slant. We will see. Let's get this back together for these girls to be dry tonight. I couldn't help but notice their perch bar is down, so I need to fix that. Oh, it just goes on and on. And on and on. I do yoga. All right, you guys, you might wonder, this is kind of a funny little coop. Um, I've had this coop for 10 years. I'll leave a link in the description on how I built this coop. The garden, gil garden girl uh, built it on video, so I just copied her design and built it alongside her, so that was good. But anyway, we were planning on building a new coop, brand new coop, and we set down this base here then I had to go to the dentist, so went to the dentist. So we spent the money on that. So we're still saving and hoping to build a new coop soon. So the girls will be drier and it'll be a coop that I'll be able to slide the doors back and walk into. <laughs> so, but, so see, I've had this for 10 years and I've had chickens and it's worked great. So you don't have to start with something fancy. <laughs> You can start with something simple and then upgrade. <clears throat> Look you guys, the sun came out. We haven't seen the sun in days. <sighs> That's nice. There it is. Here it comes, sunshine. Storm's blowing past. Yes. Victory, major homestead victory. <sighs> Fight when you're down. So, all I have to do is to get nest box back and I am done. Thanks you guys for hanging with me today. I'm gonna go inside and take a hot bath. Bye guys.